drizzle and light rain yesterday. Then the skies cleared out, temperatures dropped, and we had some fog to contend with. We had a dense fog advisory early this morning. Here's a look at that time lapse over Lancaster. And then as we head through the afternoon, starting to see some sunshine break out, and a warm front is lifting over the Susquehanna Valley right now. And look at the temperatures climb. Right now we're at 60 degrees. Dew points have come up to the 50s, so it's a little sticky out there in some locations. You can see the winds right now the east southeast at 11 miles per hour. Super Doppler 8 is still dry across the Susquehanna Valley, but look back towards Altoona and just to the west of the I-99 corridor. You can see that broken line of showers and isolated thunderstorms. That's what's headed our way, most likely between 2 o'clock and 7 o'clock across the Susquehanna Valley ahead of a cold front. It's all part of this large storm system that's moving over the Great Lakes, and it is going to be controlling our weather for days. We got a round of rain in the forecast today for your St. Patty's Day and also on into Friday. So your News 8 Storm Team forecast for today, scattered showers and a few isolated thunderstorms. Temperatures will warm into the mid 60s before the cold front moves on across the area. That will be after dark sometime around 8 to 9 o'clock. We'll have partly cloudy conditions. Temperatures will stay mild overnight. We're only dropping to the lower 40s. And then for your St. Patrick's Day holiday, we start off with some sunshine. It'll be dry to start. But then we'll see the return of a few scattered showers, most likely during the afternoon. It's going to be breezy out there. Winds could gust as high as 25 to 30 miles per hour tomorrow afternoon. Still be mild, though. Temperatures will be near 60 degrees. So the best rain chances roughly from 2 o'clock to 7 o'clock. Right around the evening rush hour is going to be for the uh, Harrisburg metro area and also Lancaster, York, and Lebanon. Then the front moves on through and our rain chances will drop off after sunset. Right now it is 64 currently in York, 60 in Lancaster. Warm front just just on the tails toward Harrisburg right now, 55 degrees and 54 in Lebanon. We're into the 70s off down to our south. And Pittsburgh's right now at 65 degrees. So the front is moving overhead. That is the warm front. This is front number one that's due in today. Here's front number two right now moving through eastern Ohio. Center of the storm will continue to pivot and spin off to our north. But watch what happens. Front moves on in closer to the Susquehanna Valley. Our rain chances will be around till roughly 7 to 8 o'clock. Then the front moves on through. Blustery conditions will be around for tomorrow. We start off dry. Notice we're at 8 o'clock in the morning. We got some sunshine and then through St. Patty's Day afternoon, scattered showers will be popping up. Then here comes another cold front into Friday morning. This will sag from north to south into the Susquehanna Valley, giving us yet another chance for some passing showers and cooler temperatures as that colder air starts to move on in from Canada. So best rain chances today during the afternoon and evening. Same type of weather expected for your Thursday in terms of timing of the rain. Isolated rain chances, but uh, on into Friday, also likely during the afternoon and evening hours. Temperatures stay mild today in the mid 60s. Those hit and miss showers will be around for St. Patty's Day afternoon. Then temperatures take a tumble after we get past Friday. Highs on Saturday and Sunday are in the 40s. There is a chance for some rain and snow showers late Sunday into Monday. As of right now, it does not look like it's going to be a big storm, but is something we're continuing to watch.